This is CBS 5 News. Good afternoon, I'm Carlos Diaz. Thank you for joining us here at noon. First up, a former Phoenix police detective who admitted to sexual abuse charges will pay for it for the next two decades. A judge officially sentenced Christopher Wilson this morning. Joe Gallus was inside the courtroom and joins us live with the new details of his punishment. Jill. Good afternoon. It was here at the Maricopa County Superior Courthouse that a judge imposed the maximum sentence for this man, former Phoenix Police Detective Christopher Wilson, who admitted to having sexual relationships with underage boys. Now keep in mind, for the past three and a half years, Wilson has been serving time for the sexual abuse charges, and now for the next 19 and a half years, he'll continue to do the same and carry out the rest of his 23-year prison sentence. In addition to this, the judge imposed lifetime probation, which also requires that Wilson now register as a sex offender. Now keep in mind, when going back to the initial case, the victims in this case were 14 and 17 years old at the time, but Wilson maintains to this day, and again emphasized to the judge today, right before he was sentenced, he did not know that the boys were underage. And those who support Wilson say he's just as much of a victim in this case as anyone else. I feel it was very harsh you know, under the circumstances. You know, we feel like you know police officers have to be held to a higher standard, but it seemed to be pretty harsh to us. And he accepted responsibility, and he cooperated with the authorities. Uh, in our society, you don't cut somebody's hand because they stole a loaf of bread. So we all agree that uh, thievery and shoplifting. Uh, should not be condoned, but are we going to cut a person's hand off? And that's really the issue. At what point does society say that the sentence is justified? Neither of the victims in this case were present for today's sentence. Back to you.